But, but she's calling other ideas you pitched, not the ones that you two are working on together, but she called other ones false promises and said that well, what you were doing was indefensible. That must bother you. Well, look, we are, of course it does, but we are in the middle of a campaign, and I, trust me, if you go to some of the statements that I made about Hillary Clinton, you can see real differences. So we have differences. There's nothing to be surprised about. Uh, that's what a campaign uh, is all about. She also said this about your supporters, and let me also uh, remind people, you should go and listen, go to the, the, the Washington Free Beacon website. They have the whole comments. You should listen to them all. But she said this about your supporters. Some are new to politics completely. They're children of the Great Recession, and they are living in their parents' basement. So if you're feeling that you're consigned to you know, being a barista or, you know, some other job that doesn't pay a lot and doesn't have much of a ladder of opportunity attached to it, then the idea that maybe, just maybe, you could be part of a political revolution is pretty appealing.